Okay, to install and configure fail to ban in Raspberry Pi OS, open a terminal and type sudo apt install fail to ban dash y. Next, type sudo systemctl enable fail to ban dash dash now. Next, type systemctl status fail to ban. And you can see that it is active and running. You can also type systemctl stop fail to ban to stop the server. Now we'll check the status again. And you can see that it is inactive dead. You can also type systemctl start fail to ban to start the server. You can check the status again. And you can see that it is active and running. And you can also restart with systemctl restart fail to ban. And check the status one last time. And it is active running. Okay, next, type sudo cp slash etsy slash fail to ban slash jail dot conf. This is the jail configuration file that we do not want to make changes. So we're going to copy it into slash etsy slash fail to ban and call it jail.local. And this is where we'll make our changes. After you've copied it, type sudo nano slash etsy slash fail to ban slash jail dot local and scroll down to the default section and we'll make a few changes Okay, the first thing I'm going to change is the ban time. This is how long an IP address gets banned. I'm going to change it from 10 minutes to 24 hours. Next, I'm going to change the find time from 10 minutes to 1 hour. And then max retries to 3. So if someone fails three times in one hour, they will be banned for 24 hours. Next, scroll down to the Jails section. And I'm using SSH and Apache Web Server. And I need to enable all of those jails. So under SSHD, and all the Apache sections, I need to add a line. It says enabled equals true.
and do the same under all the Apache sections. And when you've finished adding these enabled equals true, you can hit control X to exit. Y to save and then hit enter. And now we're going to restart fail to ban. Check the status, it's active running. So next type tail dash f slash var slash log slash fail to ban dot log and we can look at the last 10 lines of the fail to ban log in real time. And you can see the bottom one is a ban Of my own IP address on my network so I can type sudo fail to ban dash client set sshd unban IP and the IP of my system okay we'll go back to the log tail dash f and you can see that my IP address has been unbanned on the last line. So now I'm going to try to SSH into my Raspberry Pi and I'm going to fail three times with, a, with the wrong password. And you can see the first uh, failure popped up there at the bottom. I'll try again. Second password failure. And after the third failure pops up, then you should get a ban notice after that. Okay, there's my third error, and the last line is a ban. So everything seems to be working properly, and that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching.